As you guys just saw, I got the IF transformers removed in addition to the uh, two electrolytic capacitors here. Look to be the original solars. This one, it looks like somebody uh, threw a uh, pair of pliers or something on it and bent the end. And I may attempt to uh, restuff these. They appear to be dry, I believe. I'm going to go ahead and do a uh, cut right in this area here with my tubing cutters. And then we'll use a metal hole plug on the end, if that works out. Again, I'm not sure of the size here. I've got laid out. It's going to be the right size or not, but uh, I can see if I can make that work. Let me go ahead and get this cut, and then I'll cut the other one at the same height as well, so they match if I'm able to uh, restuff these units. For those that have watched my videos for a, a while now, you guys have seen me do this method before. I typically put the uh, tubing cutter in the vise and just turn the electrolytic can. In this case, I'm going to just hold it in my hand. And just make sure I'm tracking correctly. And as you can see, every few turns or so, I'm tightening down just a bit. Looks like I'm just about through. Hear a few pops. And uh, there we have it. Indeed, you can see it's uh, dry. So I think I can get the uh, guts out of this fairly easy. Okay, I've got my uh, small bolt cutters here. That's just a piece of aluminum. I think I can get in here and snip that off. Point this down. Make sure I've got my uh, safety glasses on. Alright, I should be able to pull that center piece out now, I believe. Okay, dummy. We'll do it the opposite direction here and just push it through. There we go. I think that'll work well. Let's see if this cap's going to work. I believe so with a little modification. To make the 7 8 inch cap fit, just bending the uh, prongs out here. Then I'll need to mash them back in just a bit. I think I can get a snug fit there in the can, and of course that will make it removable as well, which will be uh, great for uh, troubleshooting should the uh, capacitor fail in the future. Something else as well, if your roller on your tubing cutter is a little rough, just a simple piece of uh, painter's tape over the cap will serve well to uh, protect the uh, finish, or better protect it from any uh, scuffs, if that's a uh, concern for you. Okay, let's get smart this time. And there we have it. I'll go ahead and clean things up here and prepare the uh, capacitors. If I have them in stock, if not, I'll place an order. We'll go ahead and uh, do the uh, restuffing, get these remounted in the uh, chassis so we can proceed with the electrical restoration. Remove the uh, tape now. Okay, the old 7 8 inch hole plug works perfect. Just had to uh, build up the uh, inside of the can just a bit with a little bit of tape to create some friction. And I think we're golden there. Nice uh, snug fit. And I think that will look uh, fairly authentic once we get this back on the uh, chassis. Thanks for watching, folks.